What's up, everyone? How you doing? So this is officially now the second, uh, recording session. But, uh, we're gonna be doing things a little differently, uh, on this part, anyway. Uh, the main reason being is that, uh, well, you look at the levels we got, we're two levels behind. And in the, in the case of our main hero, three levels behind. I only say the word main hero because, well, he's first in line, you can't get him out of there. So... What's going to happen is that we're going to be grinding a little bit. Uh, while I'm doing that, I'm going to talk a bit about uh, Twitch Chicago, which I was just at. So I'm going to mute the game. And instead put on some other music. Specifically, Earth Painting from Legend of Mana, which is another game I want to do. Yeah, like that. There we go. Because for the purposes of, of doing this in a... In a relatively quick manner, I'm going to be doing this a lot. Alright, so. Met a lot of people. I was glad I actually ran into, ran into the Jackbox staff. That was actually a ton of, ton of fun. There was a ton of stuff, actually, at this little bar. It was crazy. What was, what was all there? Uh, God. Who was all there? MSI was there, which was actually kind of stunning. I kind of, I, I kind of didn't really expect, you know, a big vendor to be there. Oh, rip. I want to actually turn into an octopus. Feels bad, man. Wait, what? I can't attack with him? What happened? Oh my lord. Wow, he went all the way to Monster. Holy cow. I guess that makes sense. I guess an octopus isn't really Beast Man material. But yeah, while... But yeah, MSI at a... No. MSI at a booth. They're having people re register, register up for a, for a giveaway for a for a laptop. No idea who's going to win that. MSI also gave away a ton of stuff while, while they're there in the main give, giveaway. There's like two keyboards. Uh-oh. Next combat I need to um, no. In addition, they're making uh, streamers there to take quizzes for to win other swag. And like they gave you like this little uh, cup, this little like cup thing on the side for free, just for registering. After that, then you had to answer a gaming question. If you could do it successfully. You'd win either a dragon plushie. God dang it. Or or there was like a dragon hat. I took the plushie just because just seeing the size of it, as you can see right here, fits on the mic very nicely. So thanks to MSI for that. I do enjoy ha having another mic buddy quite a lot. You know? And, um, you know, Extra Life was there, Stack Up was there. They're both uh, charity organizations for streamers. Not charity for streamers, but, you know, you, you know what I mean. They're organizations that, that organize charity streams. Steve turned into a Lamia. I know someone that would be very happy with that, but too bad. Oh my god. There we go. Um, they had they had some photo op booths. I didn't get a 
I didn't get a chance to get, get a picture done. Mainly because the place was packed to the brim. I'm not even kidding when I say that. I posted a picture up in the Discord. And it was literally just like a small sea of people. You had to like nudge anyone to get through. It was crazy. In another room there was there was a set set up. Uh, they were uh, Twitch Chicago was on the front page for a while. Um, I did host some on my channel during that time. But oh my god. What level are they at right now? They're getting there actually. I thought it was gonna take a while because this these enemies are like three tiers lower than what we were taking on. But yeah, Jackbox was, was there. They were playing random Jackbox games. And by that I mean like w like one official Jackbox employee was was there. It was no one I knew from the uh, from the staff. It wasn't like, oh hey look, Arnie was there or, or something like that. No, it, it was it was some guy. I, I didn't recognize him from the streams. Um, they were nice enough to give me one of these, which contains a code on the back that I'm not going to show you. To get a free Jackbox game. They did that because I went in with the Depressed Pillow t-shirt. I, cha I chatted with the, with the guy. You, had a, you know, I, I, st I started streaming with, with, with Quiplash. And he was like, oh man, that's that's old by the internet standards. And it's like, yeah. Back in the OG days of the uh, Party Pack Renaissance. I, I, I think that's the best way to call it within the Jackbox world, you know? Oh my god. Accidentally became a samurai. Feels bad, man. Fixed it. And then on top of that, anyone who won games won one of these as well. Oh god dang it, I turned into a Lamia again. So that actually tells me about the the tier level I'm at right now in this game. The fact that I keep turning to a Lamy and that was the Trash Bobs that was next to uh, Byexia or whatever his or her name is. No. So yeah, I did get two of these. One for uh, nearly winning a game of uh, a true murder bear. I didn't technically win. But the person who did win was the girlfriend of the Jackbox employee. It was just like, who came in second? And it was just like, it was me. Like, oh, okay, here you go. That was nice. I will be giving these away if I have not already. I think one of these is already going to be given away. By the time this airs. The other one might not. Or maybe I gave away both in the same day. I, I still haven't decided yet. And it's the day I'm good and it's and it's the day of the Jackbox stream. Yeah, I wanna have Steve at level 21 as well. Yeah, we're gonna be plowing through. Oh, he turned into a siren? Is that a beast man? It is. Did he level? He did level. Last one, swear to god. <laughs> so yeah, that was a ton of fun. I didn't stay long. I was only there for like three hours. Uh, part of me... Part of me was just like, well look, I... I mean, it was a two-hour drive down to Chicago, but it was going to be a two-hour drive back. And I was like, as much as I felt fine, I didn't want to risk it and find out, oh god, I'm too tired to drive at 1am or something like that. And it was pushing. I actually was really tired by the time I got back, by the time I got back home. Went to bed pretty much almost immediately. I think I put, I put another one of these guys on the render queue, and that was it. After that, 
I was out. Oh my god. Stop. Yeah, everyone's now level 22 except Steve. We just gotta keep going until we get hit him to... Oh my god, please! There we go. Uh, 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 uh. Come on! Wait, what? There we go. What the hell was that? My down key just would not function. It was weird. God dang it. Although, speaking of, seeing as how I keep accidentally turning into monsters and whatnot, let's actually talk a little bit about that. Um, the other Legend game that I played, Legend 2, you could actually start off as a monster and by, god dang it. You could start off as a monster, you could start off as a robot. There was a whole bunch of other classes too that I can't remember off the top of my head. Or maybe it was just uh, male human, female human, male mutant, female mutant, robot, and monster. Maybe that is all it was. I can't remember off the top of my head. But anyway, the way it would work there is that if you're a robot, the more gear you equipped, the higher your stats would go. You never actually leveled up. But as a monster, you also never actually leveled up. You would only get stronger by eating the meat of other monsters. And you just change into a stronger monster. Which was kind of interesting and unique. But that game has a whole bunch of other flaws too. At least as far as I remember. Maybe I was just an idiot back then. Maybe there is a good game in there and I was just stupid. But I mean, I remember the stat growth on there being super random... Being very Final Fantasy 2-esque in the way it worked. Oh wait, I'm too... Oh no, we're there. Yeah, we're there. So we're actually, we're done. Yeah, I guess we're ready to go to Pureland now. Aww. That's right, because the palace wasn't blown up in the present and past. Let's go. Wow! Yeah, by the way, once you go to Pureland, that's the point of no return. You are now officially in Act 2 of the game. Status report. X-Plane. Hover. Inoperable from warp usage. Can't, can only land... Let me move on land with Rover. Let's get out. Let's split up. I will look I'll look for the advance party and you look for Faye. We'll find Soul later. Okay, good luck. So yeah, that's why I wanted to level up quite a bit before we left, because we now lose Dion. And fortunately now we're about the same now we're about the same level as Dion now. But yeah, X Plane's inoperable, which we knew. We knew it was good. We knew this was a one-way trip for now. And yeah, sure enough, hover's gone. That engine is gone. And with Rover, even though your jet looks like it can fly, it cannot. 
You can only move on land. But you know, you have a jet. Really? And also, I hope you, I hope you didn't, aren't gonna miss the old map theme too much, because here in Pur Pureland, it's gone. You only got the Talon theme on maps now. Wait, how come he... <laughs> what? Oh, whatever. But yeah, also time doesn't flow here either. Not not like it flows in the other world. So you can't warp to the to the past or future anymore. Thanks is worried these days. We can't use dive or float for traveling. Oh yeah, and dive and float won't work. Four talent crew members are living in this world. Yeah, so this world is basically, like, this is a world ruled, ruled by, like, eldritch horrors. It's kind of weird. Units? Yeah, a guy named Borgen was looking for them. Excalibur and Zakal can only be drawn by a special girl. Yeah, we already know that. So, yeah, we got a lot to search for here. Now that we finally made it to Pureland, we've got to find units... Which will give the Talon more accessibility to get places. More importantly, we need the four Mystic Swords. The Durin, the Muramasa, the Excalibur, and the Massimune. We need the four Talon crew members, which I can't remember their names. And we need all that to go take on the Masters and, to, and get to Soul. I want to say that's a one-time use thing. The ATM. Smother. And of course, when we grinded, we are richer than sin. And of course, in typical guest fashion, everyone has the... Has the, si the moment the guest leaves, you have access to the weapon tier that the guest had. How did Dion get over here and get these weapons and armor from a realm that we had no access to? We'll never know. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yeah, so it's pretty much at this point, money is now, like, no object. We are pretty much set. be replacing yep so it's this slot this slot and this slot Oh yeah, I forgot about the earrings. Uh, I don't want to get rid of that just yet. 
That x fire staff was so good. I'm reluctant to get rid of it. Especially since it gave an int boost. We'll see, we'll see. Actually, you know what? And this is this is just the exact same tier of magic we unlocked at uh, Floatland. So not exactly that big a deal. Small building, reveal your secrets. All right then. Dude, I received a star. The ship to Kenya has to wait for the ocean to clear. So yeah, because float and, and uh, dive won't work, you have to. You can only move with the talon. Boy, one step encounter is my favorite. It's great. That's pretty good damage, actually. I do not remember what's here. Right, we have a village that has been assaulted. We're looking for a friend, Faye. I see. I am... I am Etar. I saw her taken to the North Maze by Fenrir. But it turned the townsmen... Monster... The townsmen to stone. No one here can oppose them. We'll defeat it then. Really? Then take catnip from the tree. Guards will fall asleep. Rip. Yeah, that's one of the that's one of the crew members we actually have to get. I remember that sprite. Take catnip from the tree. What, this tree? Damn it. Dude, Steve's strong against Tornado. When did that happen? Alright, fine. You know what? Let's go. I like how we're wasting my items. That's great.
Yes. Oh damn, there's no water in here. Rip. Make it stop! Hmm. Of course, we don't have life yet. The game becomes so much easier once you unlock life. Not even kidding. You think I'm... I, I mean, yeah. What tree was she talking about? Yeah, she just says the tree. Goddamn tree! Oh my god, this was broken. Oh my god. I can't believe I'm, I forgot about that. Alright, so we're gonna stop here for now. We've made great progress. And we're nicely leveled up. So, see you, see you next time. You better like the talent theme, because this is all you're getting out there on the map. I do those, though.